Good morning. Wet and wild. Severe flooding in Great Britain forces thousands from their homes and leads to the biggest air evacuations there since World War II. Dick Cheney revealed the most powerful vice president in history opens up in a new book and admits the Bush administration made a major mistake in Iraq. And the $5,500 speeding ticket? Virginia may be for lovers, but if you've got a lead foot, it could cost you a fortune today, Monday, July 23rd, 2007. From NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Meredith Vieira. Live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. And good morning, everyone. Welcome to Today on a Monday Morning. I'm Matt Lauer. And I'm Ann Curry, and for Meredith's on assignment this morning. Good morning, everybody. And take a look at this, everybody. It's a, a live picture of the scene about 80 miles west of London in a place called Oxfordshire, and where there's torrential rain. Uh, it's actually all over Great Britain. Over the past month, it's causing massive flooding and is showing no signs of letting up. And rescuers are plucking people from their homes, as Matt was mentioning a little bit earlier. We're going to get a live report on this in just a moment. I was in the UK a few weeks ago, and the people there are sick and tired of it. And they're used to a little rain, mm. but they're really tired of the siege the they've had. Be. Also coming up, a story that's sending shockwaves through the National Basketball Association. A veteran referee is accused of betting on basketball over the past two seasons, including some games that he...